Charlie, give us your thoughts on the 90 minutes tonight. Uh, it was a tough match, so it was, you know, stepping up to play a championship side, you know, a good side as well, and uh, I thought the boys battled well for 90 minutes. I think uh, the scoreline doesn't reflect the game, I think it was a pretty even game, and, uh, you know, if we had took our chances in the right moments, and, you know, we conceded some sloppy goals, but, as I said, you know, it was a great learning curve for the boys, and we all enjoyed it. You touched upon it there, the boys certainly had a fair amount of chances, but it just seemed like we were unable to hit the back of the net. Yeah, it was just unfortunate tonight, you know, sometimes those are the chances we'd be putting away. Just tonight it wasn't happening for us, but uh, no, again, nobody's fault, you know, you don't point at individuals. Uh, it's a team game and we all work together, but no, obviously just disappointed with it. Playing against the full-time championship team sides, what are some of the key learning moments that you and the rest of the boys can take from tonight's match? Well, first of all, we really enjoyed it, you know, playing against stronger, more physical men that uh, give us a tougher test. And I thought the boys stood up to it and played well. Uh, you know, it's just that whenever you play against the higher level, it's the speed of play, it's the speed of your movements, you know, you don't have much, as much time on the ball. Just stuff like that, just you need to quicken up. But, uh, you know, as I said, it was, it was a good performance, I wasn't unlucky. A lot of youngsters in the squad tonight, that must be a positive to take from the squad heading into future games. 100%, uh, you know, we're a really young squad. And, you know, getting that test against good championship sides so early is, you know, pivotal for us. And all the boys done really well, stood up to it. And then obviously you've got your Lola League and you've got your youth league as well. So we've got a variety of games coming up. And uh, we're just looking forward to it. We can't wait just to get in the action.